So there's lots of videos online that show you how to watch free internet TV at home. Um, but those are mainly just sites that allow you to stream the video. And I wanted to show you the setup that I use to watch internet TV. And so here's my living room. And right now, this is just normal TV through an antenna. I get two, four, seven. Um, but if I hit the source button on the remote, you'll see it goes to my computer. Um, it's just a normal computer, nothing fancy. I think I have, I do have a $80 video card in there, and that allows me to watch a 1080p uh, movies without it skipping. But you don't need that. You just need a normal laptop or anything will pretty much do. Um, so I'm running Windows 7, and I mainly just use it to browse the internet, search things on Google. I can watch YouTube videos. And one of the main things that I use it for is to watch TV online. And there's two sites that I go to. I'll put the links down in the description. And I've done some videos on how to watch them uh, before, and I'll put those down there too. But here's Project Free TV. And that's pretty much any TV show you've ever wanted to watch. Uh, you can search for them alphabetically. You can search for them for um, the last seven days. So here's uh, all the shows that came out yesterday. And there's ESPN. Uh, so here's live ESPN that's streaming. Um, the quality isn't that great, but you can watch, you know, through VIP box, you can watch football. So I don't have to have cable to watch live sports. Um, but let me show you the actual setup and the cables you need to be able to do this. It's real simple. So to connect the computer to the TV, you're going to need to connect the audio and video. And here's the audio cable that you'll need. Um, this is just a standard mail-to-mail -mail audio cable just like you would plug in your headphones. So this is just the simplest way to do it. If you have a laptop, you can just plug it into the headphone jack and run that to your TV. And then for your video, you'll just use a standard run-of-the-mill 15-pin uh, VGA cable just like you plug in your monitor to your computer. This time though, you're plugging it into your TV. Now that comes out of the back of the computer and runs to the TV. Another thing that you're going to definitely need to have is a wireless keyboard and mouse. And uh, just a real simple wireless keyboard and mouse, I think this was 30 bucks. they came together. And this connects through a USB plug, that's how it communicates, and you're going to want a direct line of sight. But this can go 20, 30 feet. And this allows you to just sit back on your couch, and now you can control uh, everything from back here, just like you would a normal TV sitting on the couch with a remote. But now you're doing it, you can search uh, Google and things like that. But the wireless keyboard and mouse is, you definitely need that. So give it a try, let me know what you think. Like I said, it's real simple, it's just like connecting any normal computer, except instead of connecting that small monitor, you connect it to this big one, and you're controlling it through your uh, wireless keyboard and mouse. Uh, but if you have any questions, leave me a comment. And I'll put um, in the description, I'll put the links for uh, the sites you want to go to to watch free internet TV. So good luck.